train bombings. Bazelon, they're connected. He was there. We can't keep doing this. Something happened. D.E.T. in. Everything's changed. snipers we typically patrol out in front of our assault teams we usually are armed with thermals obviously night vision and infrared lasers different climbing tools to climb to the top of buildings across from the target for the assault teams it's vital that we get into positions of overwatch when the assaulters make their final movement onto the objective we turn around and focus out providing additional security for them our snipers are some of the best in the business by the time we get to the Tier 1 Command, we've got years of training and experience under our belt. We always adjust the gear we wear to the given mission. This camo pattern that I'm wearing is AOR-2, which was developed by the U.S. Navy and is now worn by the Navy Ground Forces as a woodland camo. The kit I'm wearing is just a lightweight Rhodesian, no place for working in a terrain like this. Uh, no plates is pretty key because it keeps us light. Snipers are absolutely a force multiplier, whether for Tier 1 or for any other unit. The role of the sniper is uh, still very critical. We're always working in small units, we don't have a lot of guys, and we're not there to hold ground. We're there to hit our target and leave. Get it, get it. 